we have a potential big announcement that's going to come forth on Friday. Now, the Bulletin of Atomic Scientists, that's BAS, has declared it will make a major announcement when it meets Friday morning to decide whether to move the Doomsday Clock hands. Now, the Doomsday Clock is the BAS symbolic countdown to a possible global catastrophe. The group, which is advised by a board containing 18 noble different people that meet twice annually to discuss global events, and all this was brought about in 1947, where they launched this doomsday clock as a way to reflect the basic changes in the level of continuous danger in which mankind lives in in this nuclear age. Now, when launched, the clock was an indication of how close mankind was to a nuclear catastrophe, but it was amended in modern times to also reflect climate change scenarios. Now, it doesn't change every year. In fact, the group has only moved the minute hand four times this century. It started in 1947 at seven minutes to midnight. It was at its latest point in 1953 when it was moved to 11.58 p.m. when the U.S. and Soviet Union were both testing these thermo nukes. Now, it all fell back in 1991. They moved it back to 1143. And this is when the two superpowers signed this Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty. The clock's most recent reset was in 2012, when it was pushed forward one minute to 1155 p.m. to warn humans of the dangers of unsafe nuclear reactors following this Fukushima disaster that the mainstream media never wants to talk about. So that's where it sits, okay? They said the latest was to 11.55. The highest it's ever been is 11.58. It's going to be very interesting to see where they set this on Friday morning and the reasons that they give. I'll keep you guys posted. It's been Dabu7. Peace.